so this is from uh, a company called Infinity Crates, and I'll put the link down. They, they sent me this, but yeah, like, like, like Sexy said, it is just a cardboard box. Um, and the, supposedly the idea with Infinity Crates is that it's tailored to you, so you choose different uh, different things, like, you know, Star Wars, sci-fi, um, action heroes, comic books, you know, things like that, and they tailor the items in it to you, so that now makes more sense of why it's just in a, a standard cardboard box rather than, you know, Loot Crates, for example, which has Loot Crate branding on the box, and they're all the same size because they're sending out all the same stuff, but I still feel like, because I didn't know what it was when we got it, cardboard box doesn't look that great but it is more about the stuff that's in it but they could put like a they, sticker or something yeah on it that, anything that shows yeah what it even is. just a sticker of their logo would help because we just had no idea where it was so i opened it looked at it and i was like well what, what where's all this stuff come from because i forgot that they were sending it um so yeah let's let's do it you can yeah you can hand me stuff from down there you can put it down there if it's easier like you did um is it cheaper I don't know how much is it. Uh, sign up. So I'm not. I've got no affiliate links with these or anything like that. It's just they said we can send you a box, and if you like it, you know, just I'll put this up on random bits, and you know, it's fun to do these unboxings every now and then. Uh, I can't see prices without signing up. Uh, yeah, let's, let's go. I'll keep looking. <laughs> so, that's the first item. You guys need to give us your ratings, of course, as always. Uh, what, what are your ratings for that? I think we had one this of these block things before. Kawaii Cube. Kawaii Cubes. We've definitely had one the of those flesh. in a box before. Um, I have to say, the Harley Quinn one looks very cute. Okay, so they have two different types of crates. There's a classic crate <laughs> and a premium crate. The classic crate is £17. The premium crate is £24. I don't know which one this is. I imagine it's a classic. The lightning bolt on one side folding over like that is a little bit annoying. Yeah, I know. There. Flash cube. Get three, seven, six, six, three, three out of nine. Four out of ten. I mean, this is this is a toy. This is not like a collectible. This is no, a toy for yeah. a child. Yeah, it's it's a beanbag. But what, what what's your rating? My rating, I'd probably give it a. I mean, it's soft. Really. I'd probably give it a six. I think, I think if I was to go back and look at the old video or wherever we got one of these in the past, I'd probably give it at least a five, possibly a six, but no more than that. I don't but, think. What, what about the what about this? Yeah, it's a bit like squished. It's, 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 it's not... Well, it's not squished. It's a um, seam. Ah, the seam that's attached not. in oh, there, yeah. I think. I don't know. Anyway. It's okay. It doesn't get a high rating from me. Child confirmed. Absolutely. <laughs> um, <laughs> Poopo with the race face emote. Wait, Ho Hoopo, were you here for the news? I feel like you've just tuned in. He just tuned in. He just tuned in. He didn't hear the news of the impending... Uh, well, not impending, really, is it? It's not happening soon. But, sure. That's a 10 out of 10 item. <laughs> anyway. It looks so much better in real life, because you can see, like... It. Can yeah, the see? sparkle and stuff like that. Yeah. yeah. So there's a baby on the way, too, or did I get that wrong? You definitely got that wrong. <laughs> Hook... And are these related or mm. Venom isn't that? Alien okay. Venom. <laughs> oh, maybe it is Alien, I don't know. I don't know which one's which. I don't know yeah, the difference. Yeah, it, it kind of looks like Venom. Yeah, yeah, it does. Yeah. I just saw it quickly. I don't know. <laughs> Wonder Sniff, 10 out of 10 would marry. <laughs> would marry... You. <laughs> Wait, what? what the... 9,000 out of 10. <laughs> She's talking about you, of course. You're a 10 uh, out of 10 yeah, with ring, Murray. Ring 10 out of 10. <laughs> hmm. Carnage um, and Venom. Yeah. Carnage? Uh, uh, they're okay. Oh, those two. Okay. They're okay. 
Yeah. Do you hope we'll see anything? But no. Did he disappear? He might have disappeared immediately. <laughs> <Just left. laughs> oh, no, there he is. What's the announcement? You're getting married or having a baby and I'm moving to California. No, no. No, well, no. Well, if, 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 if you pay for a place to stay for us, <laughs> uh, then yes. The first one is correct, though. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, we we can't afford living in California. I, I wanted to go there and live there for like a year, but that's impossible. Yeah. Like, it's more expensive than the four-bedroom house that we're going to stay in. Yeah. I would give these like a, a four out of ten, honestly. They're just I mean, bits of card. I, and I, I do like this one. Yeah. I like it. But... You know, they'd be... They'd, it's, they'd, it's, it's, oh, it's what a like scumbag! The corners are ruined and... They're more like postcards than... Uh, and, I, and, I, I, than I posters. Know, I, I don't know if they're supposed to be a part of it. I'm not there. I would have liked the, that. The, I think that's the problem with the way that, like, it's just a, like we said, it was a big cardboard box, and when you put stuff into that, it's going to move around because the boxes yeah. aren't tailored to the size of the items. So it feels like the packaging could be a little bit better because things are a little bit, you know, scuffed and stuff. Um, but again, it's more about the items. It's just the packaging seems to be bringing away from the items. Blank Nitro with a five months. Oh my god, bro, what an absolute scumbag. <laughs> Thank you, you Blank me Nitro. With your cable. Oh, sorry. <laughs> um, and yeah, we got a pop. I think you get a pop in every box. Yum. And we've actually had this one as well before in a previous box, and you own it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Can you move to California now? I do have to spend another book. <laughs> No, I still not. That's not going to do it, eh, Mister M. Oh, Thank wait, you for the wait. donation. I already know what your wedding gift is going to be. We don't need wedding gifts. Don't worry. We don't need anything like that. It's well, fun. I'm I'm okay with them. <laughs> <laughs> so out of ten on the pop, I would probably give that an eight. I think or uh, seven. No, sevens were I, the standard for the. Um, for me, it's more like an eight nine. Cause because you like Bioshock. it's Bioshock, yeah. and I really enjoyed Bioshock. Yeah. And I already have one, and I want the Elizabeth one. Mm, yeah. So, yeah. yeah. Alright, what's next? I don't know. You haven't brought out the big thing yet, I still know. So you're saving that to the end? Yeah. Okay. Is this an adventure shirt? It's pretty crap. An adventure I'm sorry. shirt? It looks pretty crap, did you say? It's, it's very thin. And... Well, let's mm. open it. Oh, sweetie. <laughs> He's a scumbag! He's an absolute Dangerous scumbag. with the 29 months as well. Thank you so much, man. Mm. I normally like thin t-shirts, to be honest. Mm. Avengers t-shirt. Mm. Give it your ratings. Mm. I quite like light t-shirts for summer. Mm. I quite no, I don't mind this. I don't think that's bad. If you like thick t-shirts, yeah, you wouldn't like this. Well, the t-shirt's nice, but the print? The print. Uh, yeah, see? Yeah, okay, it's kind of like a... Uh, so, okay, what do you, so, okay, what did you say? Did your parents say about you marrying so far beneath? Beneath you. <laughs> they, they love him. <laughs> They've got to be thin enough to show your nipple. Four out of ten would not wear to a wedding. <laughs> I think I think five or six I would give that. Six or ten for the design. Yeah. So that's the brainy, uh, yeah. yeah. It's kind of uh, meh. I don't, I don't really it's not like bad, but it's not. I, I, something... think, I think it will look good on you, though. Yeah. Because you've, you've got a very flat chest, and I think that will look nice with yeah. the print. I would be, never be able to wear that and make it look good. <laughs> the print would be under the boob. Yeah. It would just disappear. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, the constant change. I forgive you for moving, then again for changing the chair. I even forgive you for getting rid of the old ball haircut. But moving again, I feel like this might push our relationship to the limit. And getting married. And getting married. Mm. <laughs> Single colour print, meh. I, I, I quite like it. I think I like it better than the majority of people. But yeah, it's nothing huge. It's nothing major. There's oh, two t-shirts. We got two t-shirts. There you go, that's a bonus. What was this? This is a Gil, Gil, Gildan. Um, you got to show it no, to the stream well, before well, you yeah, give your but, opinions. It's thicker. Well, yeah, it's shitty. This this brand makes all of those cheap t-shirts. Good and heavy cotton. The, the, yeah, the, 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 the all of them do that. Print, Apart from Lucre, they do their own now. But what, what is this? I do not know what that is. What is that? 
Someone in the chat will know, I'm sure. We have too many t-shirts that we don't like. We'll give them away. Who wants it? <laughs> well, not now, but we'll do a giveaway again, like <laughs> we did for the stream. What is that? Is it like a meant to be a Batman Donnie mask? Donnie but... Darko? It does not look like a Batman mask. No, but like made to be slightly abstract. Shady shirt. The guy Don from Stranger Things. Donnie Darko. Donnie Darko. We do have a Stranger Things t-shirt and it's so much better than this. You're not so, very happy with the t-shirt itself. Well, you? that was okay. Yeah. But and this one is bad, I think. Yeah. It's not Skyrim. I wouldn't know. Yeah. One out of ten would not propose to Zexy in. And the t-shirts have been kind of meh. Are they actually... The thing one, is, there's no... Well, one out of ten. Is there no information on the... No, the thing is, it doesn't say anything. Again, you, because you, it's tailored to you, you don't get the, get the, the, the little note that tells you what things are or things like that. And with these, it never says what, where it's from. Mm. That's a problem we've had with the t-shirts that we just tucked away. Yeah, and we, we have no really idea what know it is. Exactly. Yeah. Even though I did get a card to begin with. Split helm, right side is Thor, left side... No, it doesn't look like it. Is that what it is? It does not look... No. It must be then. Uh, yeah, I, it yeah, just... Oh, yeah, it is. This, but it this, is. this threw me off. Because I don't think That's it That's Loki's, isn't it? It doesn't look that much like Loki's. Cause is this, that what it is? This is not well made. That that was my first... I don't know. That, conf confused. I don't, I Put it away. Like it. I don't like it. Goodbye. <laughs> Ready for the best part? <laughs> oh, the air freshener. <laughs> the start to be fair, I bought you an R2D2 one, didn't I? Yeah. A long I mean, time I, ago. I'm going to use it. Yeah, we have so many, though. Do you know what I find funny? <laughs> is that the air freshener is back to front? Well, first of all, air fresheners never put them in these boxes, seriously. Like, it's just. It, they always it's do. so tacky. It's like mm -hmm. shoelaces. But. What do you mean? What? What do you mean shoelaces? Well, we've had shoelaces before, like, you know, that, that's the level of thing, item. Shoe it's as bad as shoelaces. An air freshener in a box like this. Oh, that's Like, you're what paying you money mean. to get stuff and you end up getting an air like, freshener. What are you talking about? Did, did you get shoelaces in packaging? <laughs> what <laughs> no. are you talking about? <laughs> but yeah. Thank you, Dangerous. Front. Thank they, you, they, man. They put the Star Wars there. Thank you, Dangerous, for the, the 29 actual... months as well. The actual design in the back. Yeah. yeah, that's weird how it's set up. I mean, we'll use it in the car, though. We'll, new we'll ship. get some use out of it. <laughs> that's kind yeah, of funny, though. new ship. Like, what? <laughs> but that's funny. But that's not... Why? There's a scent. Oh, that's the scent. Oh, a new ship scent. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Instead of a new car smell. Yeah, new ship smell. Okay, that's funny. We will get use out of it, though. I mean, I'm going to hang it in the car, so... Maybe I'm too harsh on the air fresheners in these boxes. I'm, I'm Unless guessing, you don't have a car. I'm guessing... Well, babe, you can put them in, like, in anywhere. Yeah, that's I've true. I've told you you can put them in wardrobes and, you know, closets and, yeah. and un under the sink and stuff like that. I've literally never seen an air freshener in any other packaging. What are you on about? I'm on about the fact that Star Wars is there and the actual design is underneath instead of it being the other way around. Like, surely the design should be... I mean, that's no. not to do with the box. It, that's not the, to it's not enough that it says Star Wars up there. They have to put Star Wars there. <laughs> yeah. People are like, oh, yeah, Star Wars. I'm not talking about the packaging. and That's, uh, that's Hawk, classic air freshener packaging. New ship was at least a little funny, see? It's yeah, a little funny. but again, that's nothing to do with the box. That's but to do I, with Disney and who I, made them. I feel like you put in or wrote to them that you like Star Wars. Yeah, yeah. I, I, because... I said I like Star Wars and, yeah. <laughs> that's the main item in the thing. It's... And that's so, why the box was so big. It's so big. <laughs> <laughs> why is it so big? Where, where are we supposed to put this? It's got a bead butt. <laughs> it is cute, though. BB-8. Ooh, that's a character from Star Trek. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you, you, you could have gotten these different ones. Well, well oh, not okay. in the box, but they didn't make those look <laughs> I feel like we got the best one for this. Yeah, that Leia. doesn't... The order doesn't look great, does it? <laughs> that face, though. But R2-D2, though. 
I feel like I feel like the the, the BB-8 works best for this style of thing. Yeah, that's a good nine out of ten. That one, to be honest. I mean, it's a good item to get an item in to get an item like that in a subscription box is good unless this is the premium crate in which case seven out of ten seven out of ten would cuddle i am cuddling it right now from you want to sniff oh god yoda looks amazing the face is saying help me <laughs> i think so too so yeah i think i think help the box in general me. is uh <laughs> infinity crates so which, it's it's got its positives and negatives you know it's it's giving you something tailored more to you so you're not just getting stuff that you're not interested in i'm guessing you got wait do you get this one i think it's the premium great you know to be honest because of get premium higher valued oh yeah right because we got two yeah, t-shirts i don't think there would have been two t-shirts two pops and tees tailored to you yeah there wouldn't have been two t-shirts in the Perfect standard crate for the big time geek we, we are geeks yeah i don't think I don't think that this was. I kind of wish that that you sent me was uh, sent us one of those. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think this was worth twenty four pounds, honestly, for the premium crate. But if it was the classic crate, then it was worth it. But I don't know. I think I think the items are okay. I'm just not getting that same experience that you get when you get the other crates the way. You have some exclusive items. You get information about what's in them. The presentation's a bit better. But it's it, the main selling point is that it's giving you stuff that's tailored to you. Like, imagine we got one of those big things that was, I don't know, something not Star Wars related. And then you'd be like, yeah. But, you know, it's Star Wars and sci fi and stuff. Ha like ha, that. soccer ball, and you're so funny. Two t-shirts for $24, that's fine for me. It's not $24, it's 24 pounds, plus postage and packaging. So it's going to be more like 30 pounds for you US people, which is going to be, what, $45? If you're in the US. I don't know what the shipping is, but... Is that CU.UK, though? So it's a British company? Yeah, it is a British company. So you're going to get... It's, it could be a good option for those of you in the UK, actually, because shipping... Costs turn a, for turn a divorce fiance for your <laughs> for shipping costs for the the other the main ones make them more expensive to those of you in the UK. So maybe it is a good option for those in the UK. And if you want something more tailored to your interests, for example, and you know two t-shirts, yeah, I suppose yeah, it could be worthwhile. Uh, that are actually going to be something that you are interested in rather than, and and if you get something unique, that's another plus point to it. You're not getting. The same as everybody else every month. So there's positives and negatives to it, I think, is the best way to say it. Just like every single box has their own positives and negatives. None of them are perfect. So yeah, People. check them out if you want. People. I'll leave a link down below in the description. I'll put this up on random bits as well. People. <laughs>